selected from the chapter number 1 11.1 from the second year of physics and this is electrostatics so what is the magnitude of the force of attraction between an iron nucleus bearing a charge of q is equal to 26 electron and its innermost electron if the distance between them is 1 multiply 10 power minus 12 meter let's solve this numerical okay the given data is charge on the nucleus is q1 which is given as 26 electron and we know 26 electron is equal to 26 multiplied by 1.607 multiply 10 power minus 19 coulombs and the force of attraction between iron nucleus and innermost electron so there is a single electron the q2 charge q2 is only a single electron and we know the charge on the single electron is equal to 1.607 multiply 10 power minus 19 coulomb now the distance of separation between these two charges r is given as 1 multiply 10 power minus 12 meter and we will calculate the force of attraction f between these two charges let's solve this numerical we know according to the coulomb's law that f is equal to 1 over 4 pi epsilon naught q1 q2 divided by r square where this whole term 1 over 4 pi epsilon naught is a constant and the value of this constant term is 9 multiplied 10 power 9 newton meter square per coulomb square now substituting the values in the Coulomb's law for f we will get 9 multiplied 10 power 9 this is the value of uh, k 1.607 multiplied 10 power minus 19 this is the value of q2 which is one electron and multiply by 26 multiply 1.607 multiply 10 power minus 19 which is the charge on q1 and divided by r square taking the square of this um, this is actually r square and r square is equal to 1 multiply 10 power minus 12 whole square now let's solve this equation now 9 multiply by 1.607 multiply by 26 multiply by 1.607 we multiply these whole terms multiply by 10 power minus 19 or 10 power 9 10 power minus 19 and again 10 power minus 19 while this 12 when multiply with this 2 we will get 10 power minus 24 and shifting this minus 24 from the denominator to the nominator so this will become plus 24 so we have 10 power 9 minus 19 minus 19 plus 24 and this whole term is equal to minus 5 and multiplying these whole terms we will get f is equal to 604.29 multiply 10 power minus 5 now shifting this dot from this point to the left side we have shifted this on the two terms so we will have 6.04 multiply 10 power minus 5 plus 2 this is 2 because we are shifting this dart from the right side to the left side if we were shifting this dart from the left side to the right side then we will minus but now in this case we will add plus 2 with this minus 5 so minus 5 plus 2 will become 10 power minus 3 newton and this is our required force of attraction between the nucleus bearing charge q is equal to 26 electron and in its innermost electron that's it Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe easy video for more videos. Thank you.